Hey, here's another safety tip from Vivid Learning Systems. My name is Chris, and I'm here to share some knowledge and help you connect workers with safety. Falls are a major source of injury, with approximately 300,000 happening each year in the United States. In construction, falls are the leading cause of fatalities, with 1,300 workers dying each year. The following video shows you how to properly inspect and put on a fall protection harness. Before putting on your fall protection harness, you need to first inspect it thoroughly. Pick up the harness by the D-ring in the back. Gently shake the harness to let the straps fall into place. Make sure the buckles are unfastened. Look for any damage, such as worn, frayed, or missing threads, cracked webbing, or foreign material on the harness. If you're not sure, don't wear it. Also, check the metal strap fasteners and D-ring to make sure they are not cracked or deformed. If your harness uses grommets, make sure they are firmly attached and are not deformed or otherwise damaged. Make sure buckle tongues are firmly attached and not bent. To put the harness on, slip it over your shoulders like a vest. Make sure the D-ring is in the middle of your back directly between your shoulder blades. Pull each leg strap up and fasten the buckles together. Stand up straight and adjust the length of the side body straps as needed to make sure there is no slack. Then fasten the chest strap about mid chest high. Adjust the chest strap as necessary to remove any slack. Make sure the shoulder straps and leg straps are snug while still allowing full range of motion. Eliminate any excess slack by tightening the straps in the buckle. Make sure the loose ends of the straps are tucked into the strap retainers. With your hand held flat, you should be able to fit your fingers underneath your leg straps. Here is some final advice for using fall arrest systems safely. Do not attach fall arrest systems to guardrail systems or hoists. Remove systems from service immediately if they become subjected to fall impact, and test the integrity of the system before using again. Until next time, stay positive and stay safe.